leaked old video clip is during controversy in Connecticut's most contested congressional race. That's right. It shows one of the candidates suggesting that residents of Cheshire leave town if they don't like the property taxes. News HG political correspondent Mark Davids joins us live with the video clip and more on the race in the 5th District. Good evening, Mark. Hi, Keith and Ann. Good evening, everyone, from the Hartford Newsroom. Yeah, this is the congressional seat that's being vacated by Chris Murphy, who, as you know, is running for the United States Senate. It includes Meriden, Cheshire, and Waterbury, stretches through some of the Farmington Valley, and from Danbury north to the Massachusetts border. The race between Andrew Rohrbach of Goshen, a longtime Republican state senator from northwestern Connecticut, and one-term former Democratic state representative Elizabeth Esty, is one of the highest profile congressional races in the country. And Rohrbach is claiming that Esty is smearing his reputation with this TV ad. Andrew Rohrbach puts your retirement at risk. He'd raise the Social Security retirement age and cut the Social Security benefits you've earned. Andrew Rohrbach's just not for you. Rohrbach says he only favors changing Social Security for those who are under 50 and that at a recent forum, he said all of the recommendations of a bipartisan Social Security Commission should be considered. For my statement in Simsbury that we ought to consider the recommendations of the Simpson-Bowles Commission to be morphed into this hateful lie is a huge um, transgression. Elizabeth Esty declined to go on camera today, but issued a statement accusing Rohrbach of a flip-flop. Quote, during the Republican primary, he called changes to Social Security, including raising the retirement age and cutting cost of living adjustments, essential. Now, Senator Rohrbach is trying to deny he holds those views. But Rohrbach's campaign has also found a decade-old grainy cable access video that appears to show Esty being insensitive to taxpayers at a town meeting in Cheshire. School don't attend to or don't currently have kids in school who object to the property valuations, I would say you're always welcome to move to one of our neighboring towns. Esty does not deny what she said in the video clip, but her campaign accused Rohrbach of, quote, attacking a mom for standing up for public education. Now, Esty's husband is Dan Esty, the commissioner of the Department of Energy and Environmental Protection in the Malloy administration. Rohrbach is also accusing her of soliciting campaign funds from companies that her husband regulates as a state official. Her campaign says that's not an issue. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, News 8.